Static stability is a tendency for an object to return to equilibrium when disturbed. An example of this is a ball inside a bowl. When the ball is disturbed, it will always return to the bottom of the bowl. An instable system would accelerate further and further away from equilibrium. An example of this is a ball on an upside down bowl. The ball, when disturbed, will constantly get further and further from equilibrium. For aircraft, we have three axes to maintain static stability. We must maintain stability of roll, pitch, and yaw to be stable. This is a simple balsa wood glider. We have no control surfaces and we have no way to control it. To fly as long as possible, we must ensure stability on all three axes. For longitudinal stability, or pitch stability, the aircraft must maintain its pitch orientation. Here is the center of gravity of the aircraft. The wing center of lift is always placed aft of the CG for stability. This difference in location produces a pitch down moment from the wing. The tail is usually placed at a negative angle so to produce downforce. This results in a large pitch up moment so the aircraft will maintain its orientation. When disturbed by an upward gust of air, the wing will produce more lift resulting in a higher pitch down moment. The tail will produce less downforce due to the angle of attack approaching zero. This results in the aircraft pitching down to stabilize. This is how an aircraft will retain pitch stability. Weathercock stability, or yaw stability, is the tendency of the aircraft to maintain yaw orientation when disturbed. The vertical stabilizer is used to maintain this orientation. The vertical stabilizer consists of a symmetrical airfoil that is placed at zero degrees. When the aircraft is disturbed, however, the V-stab will be placed at some angle of attack relative to the wind vector, causing forces to be produced. The tail then produces a moment about the CG to return the aircraft to its initial yaw orientation. Lateral stability, or roll stability, is the tendency of an aircraft to maintain roll orientation when disturbed. Most aircraft have their wings placed at an upwards angle, or a positive dihedral angle. When the aircraft is rolled, one wing is placed at a lower angle of attack, and another at a higher angle of attack. The wing at a higher angle of attack produces more lift, therefore causing a greater moment that will roll the aircraft back towards wing level until the lift vectors are equal. Without dihedral, or a straight wing, when the aircraft rolls, the wings remain at the same angle of attack. Therefore, the lift produced is the same, and the aircraft will have no restorative moment to return to wings level.